When you're lost in the woods, what's the first step to getting out of the woods? Somebody take a risk. Okay, raise your, let's, do, let's do the hand raising. Somebody, I need an answer. I'm lost in the woods. What do I do? How do I get out? Yes. Just take a step. Take a random step, okay? Call a cab? <laughs> Did she say call a cab? Oh, my God. I thought this was very organized people. Yes. Climb the tree. Climb the tree. Any tree. Just pick a tree and start climbing. Okay, we got Tarzan. Say a, well, say a prayer is actually a very good answer. I can't make a joke about that. Yes. Stay positive. Okay, we're getting closer. You don't... What? No, you don't have reception. You're lost in the woods. Getting attacked by a bear. All the way in the back. Okay, let me tell you what I heard. What I heard was take a breath. Act as a warrior and look towards the sun. But, <laughs> but I have a feeling that's not what you said. Say it one more time. Oh, she did say that. Okay. One more guess. Then I just have to give you the answer. Yes, in the red shirt. Okay, okay, okay. okay. That's it. No more answers. I just want to tell you. Time out. Done. Ladies, we're done. We're done. By the way, not one man raised his hand. How can we have one suggestion from a man? Give me, brother. Yes. You, oh my God. You can't say that. What's your name? What's your name? You have to say your name. It's not a question. Jeff, can I just tell you what Jeff said? <laughs> Jeff, please just stay in your seats. You can deal with this after. Jeff, there'll be a security guard waiting for you behind the exit sign. I said, what would you, I said, maybe I shouldn't, should I say it? Yeah. Okay, what Jeff, what Jeff said was, I said, how come no men are raising their hand? And he said, because we wouldn't be lost. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't say it. Okay, okay, settle down, settle down. No, no, we have, to, we have to move on. Thank you, thank you so much. Say it again. Oh my God! We have to make peace. What, Jeff, Jeff! Yellow, come on, Jeff, Jeff. Jeff. Wait, no, we're doing the center stage. Jeff, come. Okay. It's going to be okay when I leave here and that everyone's going to be fine. Okay. So stand here. I have no idea what I'm doing, by the way. Just stand here. And I'd like you to hug. Very powerful and very, very brave. It's, it's intimidating, right? Okay, you're a brave man. Very intimidating, but they both said something very powerful because Jeff said we wouldn't be lost. And he said it as a joke, but that's how we really feel in our life most of the time. We don't admit when we're lost. We really don't. And guys especially, our culture doesn't teach us that it's, it's, it's brave to be vulnerable as a man, that it's manly to, to show your heart. Our culture says it's manly to, to, not, to not admit you're lost, right? right? Correct. But then Lisa says... We wouldn't admit that we're lost. Men, woman, boy or girl, we really have a tough time admitting our loss. We're lost. But actually, in that moment that we admit that we're lost, we're liberated in our work, in our life, in our business. We can't stay in the middle. We can't stay in the middle of the compass, in the comfort zone, because we won't be growing. But in that moment we say, I am lost, whether it's a little lost or completely lost, then we can do something about it. Give a huge round of applause for Jeff and thank you, brother. You're, you're the man. Thank you, Lisa. Thank you. Thank you so much.